Hi guys, in today's video, I will discuss about bridge amplifier. Like uh, as we know that uh, amplifiers are a device or a circuits uh, that convert a low voltage signal to a high voltage signal. Like if I have a sinusoidal voltage of amplitude, let's suppose 1 volt and minus 1 volt and I want to convert it to a higher value like uh, plus minus 10 volt, then we use amplifiers like uh, the basic and the most common is uh, op amp based operational or operational amplifier based uh, amplifiers. So in today's video, we will discuss about the bridge amplifier, its circuit, its circuit, its working principle and its simulation in a despise simulator. So what is bridge amplifier? Bridge amplifier uh, bridges are con uh, are uh, consisted is consisted of two amplifiers or two operational amplifiers which can give a high voltage or a high volt signal at the output. So basically, uh, if I uh, draw a circle of operational amplifier like the inverting one, like we have a resistor here, I we have another resistor here, and if let I give a one volt signal, sinusoidal volt signal, and if the VCC is 12 volt, the negative supply is negative rail supply is minus 12 volt, and this is 1 kilo ohm and this is 10 kilo ohm. Then, as we know that we output will be equal to minus 10 kilo ohm divided by 1 kilo ohm multiply input voltage 1 volt. So, we will get 10 volt at the output. Or if this resistor is 12 kilo ohm, then our gain will be increased and we will have 12 volt. So, we will have a 12 volt signal at the output. 12 volt minus 12 volt. So, what if uh, I want a higher value signal at the output? Like, if uh, at the same scenario I can't get, uh, yeah, or I cannot get a voltage higher than uh, higher than this 12 volt. Because uh, if I increase again, like if I increase, uh, if I increase the 12 kilo ohm resistor to let 15 kilo ohm, then uh, we out will be equal to uh, we out will equal to 15 kilo ohm divided by 1 kilo ohm minus sign or as we have inverting amplifier and one volt then we have 15 volt at the output but our positive supply rail and negative supply rail is a 12 volt minus 12 volt so our output will be uh, saturated and the op-amp output will be like this this is voltage or so op-amp will be saturated so we are not getting pure sinusoidal voltage at the output so for this uh, like uh, for this like if we have just two supply of 12 volt and minus 12 volt and we want to increase more voltage uh, than the 12 volt then we use is bridge amplifiers so uh, i will uh, draw it circuit in the bridge amplifier bridge amplifier we use two amplifiers one in inverting mode and the other amplifier in in non inverting mode so first i will uh, draw the uh, non in uh, the inverting mode this is inverting one we have ground here we have a signal here suppose it's, it's one volt signal it's 12 kilo ohm it's one kilo ohm so clearly here the output will be like inverted one and we will have output of t volt as equal to 12 kilo ohm divided by one kilo ohm we out will be equal to uh, into one volt we out will be equal to minus 12 volt minus 12 volt okay which means the output is inverted so when input is uh, plus 12 uh, plus 1 volt plus 1 volt output will be minus 12 volt and when in, when input is minus 1 volt output will be plus 12 volt we will get uh, 12 volt and minus 12 volt signal like this i will use another operational amplifier but this time i will use it in in non inverting mode as we know that so uh, we gave the input here like i will give this input the signal at this point i will grow this point and the resistor will be one kilo ohm and this will be 11 kilo ohm as we know that for non inverting the gain is equal to our uh, gain equal to one plus rf over ri this is rf and this is ri so uh, if i calculate its output value it will be like 1 plus 11 kilo ohm divided by 1 kilo ohm we in is 1 volt so we will get 12 volt okay 12 volt the output will be like this as it is non-inverting so it will not invert the input it is 12 volt it is 
minus 12 volt. Here, for non inverting, the output is uh, 8 minus A times V in, and for the in non inverting, it's plus A times V in. So, it's inverting, it's non inverting. So, if I take the output here, like if I place our load at this point, at this point, so the load will see a supply or the load will see a signal of plus minus 24 volt. Like if I place a probe here between the, the two points of the resistor, the output will be like this. It will be like if uh, I take my reference here, then it will be like this. It will be 24 volt minus 24 volt because this is because we have placed the resistor in such a way that uh, the resistor feels or the resistor uh, feels it's uh, uh, the supply is a minus 24 volt like if i draw the both both signals at a time and take its difference then we will see like the first signal is like this which is uh, 12 volt minus 12 volt which is the output of inverting amplifier and if i uh, draw the another input which is this which is of non inverting amplifier so the resistor c resistor we see the difference between the voltage which will be equal to like this like if this 12 volt minus and one minus is here minus 12 volt so overall we will see 24 volt here so we will hit 24 volt here similarly at this point this minus this equal to minus 24 volt so uh, like the 12 volt minus minus 12 volt is it will be like this and if this minus this like it is a minus 12 volt a minus it is plus 12 volt then it will it will be equal to minus 24 volt so our supply will be at minus 24 volt plus 24 volt here if i take the difference between this and this point then 12 volt minus minus 12 volt which is plus 24 volt and uh, similarly that I will take the difference between this and this point because it's the same uh, I will take I, I have taken the reference here so this voltage which is minus 12 volt minus the formula and this is plus 12 volt which is equal to minus 24 volt so minus 24 volt so for the bridge amplifier the output equation becomes 2a times v in where the two come from the, the circuit scenario like we have attached the circuit in such a way that the resistor feeds the two times voltage so now i will uh, show you the simulation and we'll verify our result so come to our simulation so here is the simulation of the bridge amplifier uh, i will open the spice i have already uh, simulated the circuit so first uh, uh, a very uh, brief in intro like uh, i have given the positive vcc negative vcc positive vcc negative vcc which is plus 12 volt and minus 12 volt and i have uh, in uh, the input signal is one volt which is sinusoidal one input with a frequency of five kilovolt which is common to both the uh, non-inverting and the inverting supply i uh, also i have placed uh, 11 kilo ohm one kilo ohm because it is a non-inverting so here the resistor will be uh, not 12 kilo ohm so uh, by running the simulation uh, we can uh, see that uh, if i uh, i if i look into the uh, inverting uh, output it is inverting the input like the input signal is uh, one plus minus one volt sinusoidal and the output is uh, inverting which is plus minus 12 volt similarly by looking at the another signal that is in uh, non inverting which is uh, like this plus minus 12 volt so in bridge amplifier we place our resistor here like let's suppose i place uh, my load here with a value of uh, by letting a value of uh, 10 kilo ohm so uh, if i run the simulation and uh, i will uh, check i will uh, or i will uh, uh, measure my value across the resistor so by writing by clicking right here and uh, mark our reference this point and then measure the voltage then we can see see that our output is plus minus 24 volt which is uh, uh, which can be easily seen here i i also can simulate this by uh, removing the resistor and measure the potential between these points like placing the reference here and then measure this point so we can see the output signal is plus minus 24 volt although our vcc and our ve is 
plus 24 volt and minus uh, sorry plus 12 volt and minus 12 volt so by just by just using single operation amplifier we can get a maximum signal of plus minus 12 volt here like we can see here like if i uh, reset the circuit uh, and uh, see the output voltage of just one op amp which is plus minus 12 volt and similarly for the other which is plus minus 12 volt so uh, by using just one op amp we can uh, get maximum plus minus 12 volt but by using uh, bridge amplifier we can make uh, or we can amplify the signal about two times of the positive supply and negative supply but the dis advantage is disadvantage here is that we are using two operation amplifiers so uh, in audio amplifiers and our in other amplifier we use is bridge amplifiers when we are limited with the uh, positive rail and negative rail supply so this is the main benefit here that we get almost or we get two times the supply voltage at the output so thank you for watching